But Sam hasn't contacted you at all about anything? No. The last time I seen her was at first when we was at the hospital with Renita. Okay. I didn't even know Renita had her toes. That was, she uh, me. I'll tell you what, that was, that was New Year's Day. That's exactly when that was. No, it was after New Year's. It? No, we went there the next day. Well, that's years. the that's last time. That no, happened. you and I were there. Okay, we were there twice. My fault, yeah. my fault. But it was only a couple days later. Yeah. I think maybe the third, because she got kicked out. She was only there four or five days before she got kicked out for posting that video. And uh, apparently someone says that she blames it on me, so I'm going to call her directly and ask the horse right to her mouth. Yeah, I would, I would too, because you... Well, I mean, what else can I do? I can't say, oh, you know, she's out of her mind, blah, blah, blah. You know, there's... I got videos that I could post that I won't out of class and decency and respect for the fact that they're struggling you know people do desperate things in desperate times i get it that's not me today i'm trying to hide my demons but i keep my demons kept coming out <laughs> okay well and that's reason really I want to stir around a little bit i just i gotta, stir I gotta well get no I gotta get out stay here. active but just take care of yourself but uh I just get information, misinformation from people, and it's like they tell me one thing, and then it's like, well, the facts might display otherwise. And I choose to go with the facts because it's going to be better for my longevity. I'm going to make a phone call with Sam herself and ask her if she told anybody that she blames me for her YouTube channel getting canceled on a video that she posted. Is I didn't post it, it's your video. I chose not to on my video. You chose to do so on yours. I don't know, who's at fault? Not me. I didn't, I didn't ask you to post it. I didn't even know you made one. Whatever. But uh, you know, that's the deal. All right, I gotta chill. My mouth is dry. I need to suck down some more of this. I got a, I got a 40, 40 ounce size of uh, um, Powerade because it's got twice the electrolytes. Man, I had a bad spell this weekend. You know, it was uh, just, never mind, who cares? Uh, all right, we'll be right back. Hello? Sam? Hello? Hello? Sam? Hey? Hey, how you doing, man? Good. Oh, well, not good. I'm tired and stuff, but... Well, I mean, at least you can, you know, lay down. <laughs> uh, I guess. What's... I, I got your, uh... I got your message earlier. Your mom had a incident? Yeah, she fell. She, like, went to go get off the bed and split. Oh, she's fine. We called 911 and they picked her up off the floor and got her into the bed. Uh, she's been really lethargic and stuff, but that's about it. Me oh. and Dad have been sleeping a lot too, so it's not just Mom that's sleeping a lot, it's me as well. Well, let me ask you this. Um, she, so they didn't take her back to the hospital. Okay, did she answer the phone? What do you mean? No, I mean, because when I called, I don't think it was you that I did. did who answered the phone when I called? Uh, when? Because. I don't know, 30 I seconds ago. The phone. Nobody answered the phone. Well, I guess if nobody answered the phone, I wouldn't be talking to somebody. I'm confused. Well, it's really not that difficult. You're confusing me. I answered the phone just now. But I never got another phone call until just now. Okay. Uh, I guess what I'm saying is I got your text. And I'm calling you back to ask you how things are going. You said your mom fell out of bed, but she's in pain and... Etc. Etc. You had to call the hospital. No, she's doing good. We didn't have to call the hospital, so I misspoke. We had to call an ambulance to let me get her out of the floor. 
I guess I would. Me and Dad weren't strong enough to get her up on her own. Okay. So otherwise, how are things going? Yeah. Hey, have you talked to Annetta at all? No. She never texted me. I gave her my number and she never texted me back. Alright. She found a place to live and stopped her spending, I guess. Kind of like James did. That seems to be a common thing with homeless people in Dalton. They get, they get a home and they stop the spending. <laughs> Well, uh, yeah, I'm not sure on that part. <laughs> you know, maybe, I guess. Cause she'll be living with her son. I remember last time we were all together, that's what she said, is she'd be living with her son. I thought you guys were supposed to, like, like collaborate and whatnot. Obviously. We were, well, we were going to, and yeah. then she showed up drunk that day. And then the last time we saw each other, the day you picked our car, her son showed up and said that he could live with her, or she could live with him. All right. Well, you know, I guess whatever, it's really none of my business, but all I'm trying to say is, uh, um, hey, I got an email. I got to ask you something. Um, what? No, I got an email from somebody, and they're, um, they said, how many, how many social media platforms are you on? Yeah. Well, it's a simple question. I don't know how many. Why? You don't know how many social media platforms are on? No, because I've got a ton of them on Hawaii. All right. The question remains. Here's the deal. Did you, have you, or have you ever blamed me for you getting your YouTube channel uh, in trouble. No. Okay. Why would I blame you? Well, that that was my thing. No, the, the, that, that's just a question because somebody said. No, because I haven't talked to anybody about it being restricted. Like I have not been online on any social media since it happened in the past week. Okay. Yeah. Well, this was so, yeah. This was just a yesterday, a yesterday. Yeah, yeah. It's a lot because I haven't been on social media, and I can't even reply to comments on my YouTube. It says it's restricted. It says my channel is restricted. Right. But that doesn't mean you can't say it on Facebook or Instagram or. I don't have a public Facebook. My Facebook is private. What about my Instagram? I don't use it, and I haven't used it in almost a year. What about TikTok? TikTok, I can't access it right now because I don't have internet. All right. No, it was just weird. That's why I haven't been on anything in a week because I don't have internet. That's why I don't understand what people are claiming I blamed you when there's no reason for me to blame you since it was my account. They got. It. <laughs> that was that was my point exactly. Uh, all I'm trying to say is like, you know, I'm not here to hurt anybody, put them in a bad spot, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And somebody emailed me and said, you know, that's why I have to talk to the source. And it, in this case, yeah. in this case, you are the source. You know, if you didn't do it, you didn't do it. Yeah. yeah, and I don't even know when I would have said that because I haven't been on YouTube or been able to respond to comments. I, I haven't responded to anybody's comments in almost two weeks now. Yeah, it's been a and little I bit though. I can't respond on YouTube because it's so restricted. I can't even comment on your videos. It just says it's restricted for me. I don't know what's going on with YouTube. I'm going to have to email them, I guess. Yeah. I don't know. Well, I guess I guess there could be worse things to worry about. I mean, yeah, I know I know it's a big deal, you know, for I do got some good news. I'm not picking a job. Fantastic. What are you gonna do? Uh I'm going to family dollar. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to get family dollar. Nice. Hey man, in like ten days you'll be a manager. No, that's, that's... Actually, my dad's friends with the owner and the managers, so 
that's why he's going to be able to get me a job despite having no all that. Okay. How's that one she's, bed working out? That's fine. Wow. Me and my dad are both small, so we can all fit in bed. <laughs> right. No, I got you. So I'm going to actually cater the remaining money on the uh, website for my because my mom's card only paid for 60 of it, and she paid the remaining 50. All right. Well, no, I just wanted to clarify because, you know, here's been a thing that's been happening with me over the past few months is that, you know, I respond to one thing and I take it out on someone else and it ends up turning out, it's like, well, hey, man, I never said that. Or this didn't happen, that didn't happen, blah, 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 whatever. Point is, is that I got to get both sides of the story. So, like I said, I got this email from miscellaneous person. Well, and yeah, that doesn't even sound familiar. You're the only person I've emailed. It's like Gavin Hayes, uh, and I only talked to him like two, three times. And oh, so you have talked talk to that I'm guy. All right, you have talked to Gavin. Him and Darlene are the only people I've talked to, but okay. Darlene, I only ever called her, and I haven't called her. Well, no, that's no. fine. But no, my point is, is that I was told in this email that you had said you're blaming me for you getting kicked out of YouTube. What? If I even said that, it would have been a joke. Wait, say that again. I said, if I would have even said that, it would have just been a joke. But, so you don't, you're not denying that you said that? No, I am denying that I said that. But oh, I'm okay. If I would have, been, like, if in any circumstance I would have said that, I would have been joking. I wouldn't have been serious about that because I have no reason to blame. Well, no, that's, that would, that would be my question as well. I mean, it's like... All right, I, no, that's cool, but it's like, you know. If anything, I'll blame YouTube for it because YouTube's the one that fucked up and did it. <laughs> yeah, they're they're pretty strict on quite a bit of stuff. Yeah. But, you know, they're a multi-billion-dollar operation, so I guess you gotta, you know. But, uh, yeah, but I gotta get off there. My dad's trying to sleep, and he's getting on the way. Okay. All right, no, I just I just wanted to clarify that because uh, yeah. just to set the record straight, so I have not caused you any social media trouble. No. No. All right, well that's cool. All right, well thank you very much, and uh, right. yeah, if you need any, if you got any questions or uh, your service is going to run out here in about ten All days. Right. So. All right, what? I said your service. Is gonna run out in about ten days. Okay. No, just so you know. Yeah. All right. Thank you for telling me. Cause I completely forgot. Yeah, you got to get that twenty-five dollar card. So. Yeah. Um. Uh, yeah, I mean, my dad will have to find some money soon, man. It'll be fine. We'll figure something out. Yeah. Well. All right. Well, I'm gonna get off here. Yeah. Was that your dad? Yeah. I thought he was sleeping. He's trying to, but he's awake because I'm on the phone. But oh. I need to get off the phone. All right, cool. All right. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. All right. All right, yeah. see ya. Come on, buddy. Check it out, guys. That's the brew. Got hit by a car. He's functional. He insisted on going today even though it's so crappy and uh, he's making his way he favors that left rear leg and there's that genuine one eye that you'll see when they're you know when they walk away uh, no the point is, is that he has got to go pee pee this is our famous spot we stop here quite frequently but uh you know that's the deal but uh, man it's raining we're, we're, we're under a winter storm advisory batting down the hatches 
close the schools. Kids are texting each other. Xbox. Can't wait. Yeah, he wants to play. Look at him gimp. He looks like the other dog. Anyway. Well, wow, what a day. I mean, I'll tell the truth, what a month. I was incapacitated. Man, I'll tell you what. I was down for the count. I don't know what happened. I don't know if I got a 24-hour thing or whatever, but point is, is like, man, what the hell? Got to be more than life than this. <laughs> Generally speaking, you know, stand up. You want to fall down. You so weak you can't even. Your legs tremble when you stand. It's like what the hell? All right, cool. Fourteen gallons of chicken noodle and a bunch of veggies. Fix all that. Oh, he's taking a dump. Good. I was worried about that. He's got to. Everybody poops. He's got to poop. Good deal. I would, no, I'll just make sure because I have to know for a fact for a veterinarian's sake. Now he's totally hidden because, you know, nobody likes to take a dump in public. I mean, come on. It's like, it just is what it is. But, uh, all right, we'll be back.